guys, uh, today I want to show you how to unfold surface inside the Rhino. So this is actually a uh, part from Klein here. So I just want to show you how to unfold this surface here. So this is actually, there are many surfaces here. And to just show you how to unfold a few of them here. So you see here, this is actually a sphere. And the surface here just attached to the sphere. So this is actually a quite a regular surface, so the accuracy should be very high, so it should be no problem. And if you if you see here, this is actually then the uh, first actually if you load download the software from our website, then we install the software. You need to go to the uh, options here, and then inside the plugin here, you go to installed, and then they will ask you to load this uh, advanced Rhino surface here. Uh, advanced smart unfold for Rhino here. So, and then you're going to see here, this is actually the our product here. Once you load it here, and then you can just type as unfold, and they will just select the surface here. This is actually a very simple surface you just select. And then they uh, give you the unfold step numbers here, and then normally you choose 50 to 100. So for this one here, just use default here, and uh, type return and then they ask you whether uh, where you can put the unfold results here it's just put in the tangent here and then you can put also on the xy plane here so and uh, and then hit return oh here is actually the curve or uh, point on the model surface if you want to unfold them together like a seam line or marking line now you can select them here since you don't have this uh, you don't have this kind of uh, point curves you just hit return and uh, yeah, that's it here. See here, this is actually the result here. And this is the unfold result here. You can see the area. I uh, just want to show the area that unfolded contour here. That is actually then the, the area of the unfolded results. And then you can choose the model area is like this one here. That should be not this one. Okay, so that's make a mistake the area. And, and show this. yeah, this is actually the model area. So you can see here that should be uh, very accurate here. And uh, this is actually this guy. And then you can just unfold this surface here. And this one here, you know. And just type as unfold surface on so this one here choose a roughly a little middle of the surface and then you just hit return and then they will just you give the results here so uh, let me see here the area so the area and the area of the unfolded contour going to be this one here so and normally for this kind of a uh, uh, surface here I mean this is actually quite regular and all the small area on the uh, sphere and then the result should be uh, well less than 0.1% uh, of the between the unfold contour and the unfold uh, the model model data like you know the area or the edges should be very accurate for these kind of things here so and then just can we choose another one here yeah for this one here just show here just unfold no uh, as unfold here and then you just here hit return yes and then you have the result here. I can just show then. I mean, this is. I just want to show you the area, and then you can just show the ages here. Yeah, I should be the same here. So you just show the area, and then you can show the area of another one here. For this one here, that should be the 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 same here. It should be the difference should be very small. And uh, going to be unfold this one here. See what happen. 
as I unfold the surface here and then you can have here uh, just one moment here this is actually where it's unfolded here uh, let me check just one moment as I unfold the surface here and going to be select this one here select contour select yeah see here and this is actually the one here the the one that is unfolded here so and that is actually same as the previous one here you can just see the area of the unfolded contour and then you can see the model area yeah that should be should be very same here so uh, this is actually the yeah if you compare the age it should be the same here see so just for a kind just moment here so uh, x ages yeah this is actually I uh, just okay I mean if you want to uh, compare the ages to be exactly the same uh, tolerance uh, within the same uh, tolerance so it's very diff uh, very small differences uh, because of this uh, uh, shape of this surface is quite regular I mean you can unfold all of them here so just uh, just want to show you a few of them here and that's for today good thank you bye